Hi guys, welcome. This is, um, well, Carly. Does it matter? No, it doesn't matter. What I'm going to explain is a nice application that you can do on Arch Linux. Pseudo Pacman minus S pace, right? This is Carly. So Carly has no repositories. Not the ones we have, right? This is all pure core extra community. So pure Arch Linux, but we gave it something. Does it have yay? It does. So yay wave and the guys are oh, sorry. <laughs> I always type wave. I don't know why pace and um, the guys that have um, Arch Linux, they do pseudo pacman minus s and that's faster. We, we need to build things and it's all the way up at the top somewhere AOR. So this is what I don't like that we need to scroll all the way up and you can set all these things um, in your system, right? Minus S base. That's gonna fix it. Don't have to look it for it now. It's just tell it to install it. So all these packages need to come in. And why is space? Well, base you can select it in Calamars right now if you install, but it's also going to go by default on Arclix XL. And XL is the one where you get to know Linux basically and get to know all the applications. And it is great in the sense that it will give you an overview of one of the most important things that there is in your system. And that's Pacman. Pacman is your package manager. And in here you'll see that the, there is a Carly repo. So pacman.conf etc slash pacman.conf. It's not available. Testing is not available. Core is, extra is. These are all the repositories. Where are the packages coming from? From stores, so to speak, right? Repositories. And you have some options here as well. This gives you a great summary of everything that's important of Pacman. Root directory, where is the databases? Where are all the packages, the cache? Where are they? Is there a log? There is. And there are keys. Keys are somewhere, right? They are kept and are updated. There are hooks, things that Pacman does when installing, when uninstalling, when removing, uh, the same, when upgrading, that's another one, stuff like that. Packages you wanna keep, you say, don't update this thing or don't remove this thing, hold packages, right? Don't remove this thing and so on and so on. Ignore packages, that's don't update this thing. Ignore a package or a group that you ignore. This is really keep this for sure, always on my system, hold package. All right, no progress bar, color, no color, check space, parallel downloads, you wanna crank it up. We've got, I love candy, right? So it's there. And this is an interesting page. And then the mirror lists, Arclex, ISO, GitLab, the Carly mirror list, and the mirror list, Aya from Arch Linux all the guys at the moment but if you say for some reason don't want to have this boom it's out it's not there anymore and when you update your system it's going to be coming from the first line so i'm showing you this on carly because i want to th my my main aim is think out of the box right arch linux anything Arch Linux based, wherever, whatever you're using. If you can install this particular application, right, Pace, then you can learn from it and see, okay, that's how it's uh, all governed and changed and voila, you can change some things. But basically, this is the reason why I've put it on the Arch Linux XL. So you can have a look what is in here, right? I know, I know people like graphical user interfaces, but it's the same thing. What's here is now in a nice graphical user interface and you check it out. DB path var lib pacman, var lib pacman, check. You see, 
and it goes on pacman glib c hold packages but when i saw that i recognized immediately etcpacman.conf but if you're new then this makes sense that you get to know things like like this it's okay it's a good tool so pace is there on adclix xl and if you like what you see you can just install it all right cheers